Hi everyone. In today's video, we are going to see how we can create a tasker profile which can execute every hour. So if you have a requirement in which you want to execute any task after uh, some period of duration, then uh, this video is for you. So in order to do that, what we need to do is we need to create a profile. So you can access profile by clicking on profile and then click on add and then you need to choose create. When you choose create, you need to select time profile. So in that uh, it will show you what will be the initial time. So for how long this profile should be there and then uh, we will use some parameters. So let's just say that uh, I want to use this profile between 9 am. So this will be 9, 9 am to uh, maybe 5 p.m. So this is 5 p.m. Sorry about uh, the screen resolution of my mobile. So this is p.m. And then uh, for how long you need to like uh, repeat this. So if you, it is saying that that if you want uh, lower than two minutes, you can use tick even in your profile. So we don't need that because uh, most of the time it is not consistent. So I will not recommend that. But if you have any requirement like this, then you can always do that. So let's just uh, select it every. So as you can see here, uh, we will have two things, hours and minutes. So we wants to do a hour. So I will just use four for now. So what it will do is it will execute a task around nine, nine a.m. And then it will wait for four hours and then it will repeat it again. And then uh, it will keep on going until the last time you have defined. And when that, then when uh, it reaches beyond that time, then it will not going to execute. So four hours is this, and then when we can use back. And here you need to create a task. So I can just use a test vibration. So you can choose any task you want from this uh, list. So I will use test vibration. So now uh, this task will be executed every four hours between 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. So that uh, you can see that is how it's, it is simple uh, to use a time profile with the task. So I hope uh, you get some overview about this. And uh, if you have any question, please comment below. I will try to answer them as soon as possible. And thanks for watching. Meet you in the next video. Bye.